guys, welcome back to the DNN medical series. We're going to basically talk about your fingernails. So if your fingernails could talk, what would they be saying to you? So let's jump into these six issues. So the first one is when you have brittle nails. You can see these nails just break very easily. They are so soft and this is a uh, can be responsible. What can be responsible for this is poor nutrition, especially when you're low in your vitamin A, your vitamin C, or your or your biotin, or you have hypothyroidism. Your thyroid gland is not producing enough hormones, so you can have thin, brittle nails. The next one is yellow nails. So you can see yellow nails right here. It can also suggest that you have diabetes, hypothyroidism again, psoriasis, which is basically a skin disorder or a skin disease that causes red, itchy, scaly patches, and it mostly come on over your knees, your elbows, your trunk, and your scalp. So this can cause you to have yellow nails. And another thing to note is that yellow nails, like thick yellow nails, can indicate a nail fungus. And the next one is nail pits or depression. So there's this depression in your nails. So this can also be as a cause of psoriasis again, as you can see. And as I said, that's a skin disease. And it can also be as a cause of alopecia areata. So this is basically an autoimmune disease that usually results in un unpredictable patchy hair loss. So this... Your hair is falling out, you don't know why. This can cause nail pitting or nail depression. Next one is virtual ridges. So you have some lines, some straight lines going upwards vertically. And this is basically very common with aging. As you get older, you can have virtual ridges. And it can also be seen in iron deficiency anemia. So if you're seeing virtual ridges, you need to go and get some iron up. Next one is horizontal ridges. You see the line going across. Instead of upwards, it's going across. You, this is common in diabetes, kidney conditions, as well as zinc deficiency. So you see those lines going across? Go and get those zincs. Go and get checked out for diabetes. Go and check about your kidneys and so on. And the last one is the dark streaks are marked. So you see those dark lines in your fingernails. It can be from a broken blood vessel like to trauma, something fell on your nail, stuff like that. Your nail got caught in something. It can have broken blood vessels and can cause that. It can also be a cause of psoriasis as well as endocarditis, which is a heart infection. So basically when you see black streak, it's not from trauma, it's not from psoriasis, and it's just happened to be there. It can be a heart condition. So that's very important to note. And the last thing about the black blacking of the nails is basically melanoma. This is basically a cancer of the skin. If you see a clean black streak in your nails and it's not the cause of the, any other causes, it can be melanoma. So that's all about your nails today and i hope you listen to your nails when they're talking to you and until next time see you soon